Hey guys, today I'm here with episode 13 of my Oakland Raiders franchise mode here on Madden 15 and we're here in week 12 going up against our division opponent, the Kansas City Chiefs. We are still without Matt Schaub and they are without Tom Bahali and some people ask me um, what my sliders set are. So here's my sliders, you can pause it at your time and see what I have as my sliders. So it was actually really weird because in the last episode you guys know that Derek Carr got hurt and it said he was out for four weeks. And then when I checked the injury report for this week, it says he wasn't hurt. So I'm just going to go with it. I'm actually happier that he's not hurt. So we're still going to be using Derek Carr and he will not be injured. So we are here in the Oco Coliseum and it's actually really cool playing in a West Coast stadium at night. It's actually pretty cool like the stadium wise and I don't know if they get too many games unless it's prime time out on the west coast because it would be like like prime time here on the eastern time would be like 8 30 and then there it would be 5 30 so it'd be different so we are electing to receive the ball first marcus whedon's gonna bring it out to the 20 yard line and um in comes Derek carr our rookie quarterback he has 497 yards four touchdowns and one interception in two games so his first play is a handoff to Maurice Jones Drew, and he's going to get a gain of 8 out to the 28. Now, first and 10 from the 35. It's a handoff back to Jones Drew, and Jones Drew is going to pick up a gain of about only 2 yards. So it will be second and 8. We're going to pass it for the first time. Carr is going to find Streeter, but it is knocked out of his hands, and that's going to be an incomplete pass. So that's going to force a third and 8 here for the Raiders. Third and eight from the 37. Carr is going to drop back. He's going to find Whedon, but Whedon cannot hold on, and that's going to be a punt away. So the Chiefs would have great field position starting off. First and 10 from the 44 to hand off to Charles. the One of the best running backs in the game is going to get a gain of 15 on the ground out to 30. First and 10 eye formation for the Chiefs. It's a handoff back to Charles. Charles bounces to the outside, cuts back in, and he's out at the 12. He's already got two rushes for 32 yards. And now it's a handoff back to Charles up the middle, and he's going to get a gain of 8 yards out to the 4. Now, first and goal from the 2. It's going to be a handoff. No, Smith's going to keep it on the option, and he is in for the touchdown. We were not expecting Smith to run it there, as Jamal Charles was killing us this game so far. So we expected him to give it to Charles, and the Chiefs are going to take an early 7-0 lead. And now Jones Drew here is going to get a loss of 3. So we would have a 3rd and 4 from the 46. Carr is going to find James Jones for the first down out to the 46. So across midfield now. Third and 12 from the 49. Carr is going to drop back. And Carr is looking for James Jones. But instead, Sean Smith's going to get the interception. And he's going to get knocked out of bounds at the 41. So that's Carr, I believe, third interception as a Oakland Raider. And now the Chiefs have a chance to go by two possessions. So first and 10 from the 41. Smith's going to find a deal. Neil Alexander. But I believe that was Carlos Rogers who knocked out of his hand. So a great play by him. Now third and five from the 37. Smith's going to keep him himself. But Smith is going to go down by Nick Roach out to the 37. And they're going to be forced to punt it away. So third and 10 from the 20. Carr is going to find Whedon on the out route. He's going to start a step and get knocked out of bounds at the 41. We would have a second and two now from the 49. It's a handoff to Jones Drew. And Jones Drew is going to find his way for the first down and more. Cross midfield now out the, out the 42. Second and 10 now from the 42. First quarter coming to a close. It's a screen play. It's a curl play to Osbury, I should say. He's going to pick up the first down. Carr is struggling to start off this game. Now it's a handoff to Dree Archer. He's going to shut off one tackle, but Dree Archer cannot pick up the first down. Only a gain of three. Third and one now from the 20. Hand off to Jones Drew. And Jones Drew's got space. And he's going to get a gain of six. He's got nine carries for 40 yards. So we're in the second quarter now. Third and three from the seven. Another hand off to Jones Drew. And he's going to fight his way to the one yard line. And first and goal from the one. We're going to give it back to Jones Drew. And Jones Drew here is going to dive his way into the end zone for a touchdown. And the Oakland Raiders are going to tie this game up at seven on the Maurice Jones Drew one yard touchdown run. So, the Chiefs are going to have the ball at the 41 now. It is tied. It's a handoff to Charles, and Charles is going to pick up a gain of 8 yards. He's got 5 carries for 63 yards. That's more than 10 yards per carry. So, now, Smith's going to find Hemingway here for a gain of about uh, 11. And now, it's 3rd and 6 from the 25. This could be a big 3rd down stop to only hold them to a field goal. Travis Kelsey in motion. Smith's going to drop back in the pocket. He's going to try to look in the left to Charles. It is overthrown. 
and that's going to be a field goal. So we're at the two-minute warning now. We're down by three. Looking to put up more points before halftime. Carr's going to drop back. Carr's going to find David Osbury, and David Osbury's going to get a big gain out to the 43, a gain of 23. So now third and two from the 49. It's play action. Carr is going to get sacked. And that is going to be a big sack for the Chiefs as we're going to be forced to punt it away. Now Smith has it, 39 from the 21. And Alex Smith's going to find, I believe that was Dwayne Bowe over the middle for the first down. Now first and 10 from the 36. It's a screenplay. Smith's going to find Charles. He's going to pick up a couple nice blocks. And Charles is going to get knocked out of bounds at the 39. And only a gain of three. So now third and seven from the 39. A minute left to go in the second quarter. Smith's going to drop back to throw. All the time in the world, he's going to lob it up to the left sideline. And Dwayne Bowie is going to come down with it. But the ref says he did have one foot out of bounds. So that's going to be a punt away. But we would eventually not do anything with the ball. So we're now here in the second half. Chiefs do have the ball. Now third and seven from the 23. Smith's going to find Bo over the middle for the first down. A gain of 15. First and 10 now from the 37. It's a handoff to Charles, and Charles has been killing us today, and he's going to pick up a gain of 8. He's got 12 carries for 94 yards, and it's another handoff to Charles, and he's going to get another decent gain out to the 47. So cross midfield now for the Chiefs. McKnight in the backfield this time. It's a handoff to McKnight, and down goes McKnight. Khalil Mack and Seomore are two outside linebackers with the tackle right there. As we're going to force a third and 10 from the 48. Smith's going to drop back. And he's going to lob this one up. And it is somehow caught by Hemingway. Charles Woodson could not pick that off or just deflect that. And Hemingway's going to have a big gain. So now Smith's going to hand off to Charles. And Charles is going to get a gain of five. Has over 100 yards. And now Joe McKnight's going to pick up the touchdown. The former New York Jet with the touchdown. And the Kansas City Chiefs are going to take a 17-7 lead. So now we have the ball back. Play action for Carr. And Carr is going to get actually a gain of one off this. was pretty surprising. But uh, Derek Johnson with the hit in the backfield. So now we run a screenplay to James Jones. And James Jones is just short of the first down marker. And we're going to be forced to punt it away. But we would eventually force the Chiefs to a 3 and out. So we have the ball again. First and 10 to hand off to Jones Drew. And Derek Johnson is right there. So now third and four from the 26. Carr is calling some audibles at the line. Play clock winding down. Carr is going to drop back. And Carr is going to find Marcus Whedon over the middle for the first down. A gain of six out to the 32. First and 10 now from the 32. We're in the fourth quarter. We got to score quickly now. Carr. Pressure is coming. And down goes Derek Carr. Don Terry Poe with the sack. That's his third of the game. Second and long now for the Raiders. It's play action. Carr's going to roll out to the right. And Carr's going to pick up that first down. David Osbury is going to catch it and stumble his way out to the 43. First and 10 now from the 43. Carr's going to drop back. Carr is going to find Michael Rivera. Our second string tight end over the middle for the first down. Out to the 36. Second and 11 from the 37. It's a handoff to Jones Drew. Jones Drew is not going to pick up much. He's out to 33. He's got 19 carries for 59 yards. Now third and seven from the 33. We need a first down here. Carr is going to drop back. Carr is going to find Rod Sheeter over the middle who's going to hold on a gain of eight. Now third and six from the 20. It's a screen play. Jones Drew's going to get it. And Jones Drew's going to pick up the first down. He's going to get knocked down at the 7. Now second to go from the 2. Dre Archer's in the backfield. And Dre Archer is going to fight his way for his first career NFL touchdown. Save that ball for Mr. Archer because that's his first career NFL rushing touchdown. So now we only find ourselves down by a field goal. We got to stop Jamal Charles and the Kansas City Chiefs offense. They're going to pick up a decent game right there. Now third and five from the 25. Two minute warning approaching. Smith is going to drop back. He's going to roll to the right. All the time in the world he's going to take off and run it. And he's going to pick up the first down. And a two minute warning will hit. Now it's third and three with 30 seconds left. We're trying to get a stop here. Joe McKnight's going to break off one tackle. And he will pick up the first down. And that eventually will be the end of the game. We do lose to a divisional opponent, 17-14, to and another loss is added on to our record this year. And our team didn't play too great. Our defense gave up so many yards on the ground, and that's something we do have to look at in the offseason. That was it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed episode 13 of the Oakland Raiders franchise mode here on Madden 15. Leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you're not already, and I'll see you guys in the next video.